Hey guys, welcome. Hope y'all are doing well today. We're going to be playing Rayman games today, which is to say, tangentially related to Rayman video game. Wow, that was okay. I speak that one. Fancy seeing you here. I know. So Greg was in my chat before the stream started, just juicing up the audio counter for some reason. I don't know why. <clears throat> that doesn't apply here. I'm I'm not in that country where that applies. So, sorry. You're under arrest. Great. Sweet. Great. I haven't played this game before. I've heard nothing but good things. What a huge Mario nerd. All right, Beepo. That ought to fix the overheating problem. Can you believe it's been three months since Tech Magazine put me? Okay, us on the cover? The Super Merge takes item A and item B and combines them to create item C. Ugh, if only it were that easy. The article says nothing about dark matter, space-time manipulation, practical applications, nothing. I mean, the Super Merge could solve the energy crisis, Beepo. Watch. Let's solve the energy crisis. Let's do it. Sorry, Beepo. Let's take a break and come back at this overheating thing fresh, okay? See you, Beepo. Hey, Kurt. And then a magical portal. With the Rayman spinoff. Hey Val. Hippo is a Roomba, it's true. Killed him. Hey Val. Did I already say hey Val? Hey everybody. I've already seen this opening cutscene. I've seen a little bit of the intro of this game. So, excuse me while I'm not enthralled. Everything was fine. Oh, keep me posted on audio stuff, BT dubs. <clears throat> it's a statue of her. Wow. How selfless. Oh, bye, Toads. Ow! Our brother. Bye, Luigi. Hey, Peach. No Yoshi! I'll miss Yoshi. Can we talk about how it wasn't Peach's hand in that shot and it was Luigi's hand? That's real love. Right there. Anyway, how's everybody doing? We're gonna play some XCOM... XCOM Mario Rabbids Kingdom Death Battle. Okay, he was just on a toilet. <clears throat> oh, 
Oh no! That would be horrifying. No one wants to get fused with a VR headset. That sounds like the worst. Curious thing imaginable. Now you're a paintbrush. Congratulations. And you got a cheese gun? For some reason? Oh no, I just feel bad for this thing. On Game Dev 2 making Rayman clone. Replay as <laughs> Ernie Sanders, but instead of. What? <laughs> I haven't touched the controller in a while. Uh. Well, there's our cold open. Uh. But instead of electoons or lums in cages, you're releasing immigrant children. Holy shit. That's amazing. Get to work on it. Uh, Ubisoft. Hello. Oh, look, it's your person, Princess Peach. There's a lot happening. Yuck. Oh, they're just sticking them together? Nice. Now it's his double Goomba. Ziggy. That's her name, I guess. Hey, what's up, Roomba? In Juvenile Class Chaos Mayhem, more so than usual, even. Like our two friends here, they seem to have been corrupted by that rabid wearing a super merge headset. Could it be the super merge headset was corrupted on its way to this world? If so, we're all in terrible danger. All right, we must find that poor rabid fused with the headset. He is the key. Save him. We might save this world. I play as a Roomba and I collect coins, and that's the whole video game. Wow. <clears throat> Super Mario 3. Hang on. I'm changing my TV settings. Vivid is too vivid. Uh. For my eyeballs. This game is very colorful. Okay. Look, I love Beepo. Beepo's good. Look at Beepo. Beepo. Look at that Goomba. He's stuck in just a tube of honey. What's this? Oh no! A shocking though admittedly hilarious example of chaos wrought by the intrusion of our world into this one. Okay. So hey, anybody watched the Smash Track this morning? Anybody, anybody salty about it? Hey Royal. Smash XCOM. You did. Basically, make this TV <laughs> stand out in a store mode. That's fair. Nah, I'm laughing my head off. Yeah. My thing is, like, Ubisoft clearly had some poll about the uh, amiibo costumes, and they chose Altair and Rabbids. No Rayman. But there's some Ubisoft love in there. Also, Cuphead. That's very exciting. That's very cool. The more indie characters that get... Uh, actual uh, fighter costumes. The more I wish Shovel Knight had one. What are you gonna do? He's in there. So, that matters. Boop, boop, boop. Is the new meta? Hmm. Cuphead with music. Yeah. Man, the, the weirdest thing about the Smash Direct, like, I'm not really that miffed about, like, oh no, a character I didn't like got in. Um... The only thing is that the first, like, f 10 minutes is like, hey, do you know what Fire Emblem is? Hey, here's what Fire Emblem is. Let me explain to you what Fire Emblem is. I don't know if you've heard of Fire Emblem. Here's Fire Emblem. This is a Fire Emblem commercial. Have you heard of Fire Emblem? Please buy Fire Emblem. Even though I'm pretty sure Fire Emblem did really good. <clears throat> I learned how to count in binary. I didn't. Because I'm dumb. It was just, it felt really weird. It felt like a sales pitch. <laughs> it felt like the Smash Direct was, hey, please buy Fire Emblem. 
<clears throat> just received a message. Dear is Beep from FB. Facebook. Uh, Beepo, whose bravery, intelligence, and compassion stand as a beacon of hope for us all. If my timing is correct, you are in dire need of help. Beepo, did you send this email? It's okay if you sent this email. Please open the attachment to this message. Their receipt is most suspicious, I assure you. Biggest fan. And then we gave Mario a gun. Hey, Karisu. You're so angry about that? What, the first 10 minutes being, hey, Framblam? Hey, please, hey, do you know what Framblam is? Wow, when the email said attachments, I thought it was talking about cat videos or something. So, are you guys ready to fight back? Sure. Time to learn the basics. Uh, binary is just a different base, which means every two in your count is equivalent to adding zero at the end. So, for example, one, two, three, four, five, six is one, ten, eleven, one hundred, one oh one, one ten. I see. I'll never get what I want. I've been from Golden Sun. Yeah. I love learning about Framblam. You mean that series that you already love and have played a lot of? <laughs> Golden Sun Raps? Uh, I remember Golden Sun floating around on the playground when I was a kid, but I've never played it myself. I've only played three games. I've played more than you. No, that's not true. No, but you've played Awakening, and then there was like two more on the 3DS. Uh, the, the smashy one counts. And then Three Houses. That's like four. <clears throat> anyway, yeah, it felt really weird. It felt like the, it was like, hey, audience, I don't know if you've heard of this thing. I know that like, there's a bunch of fighters in this game that are from Fire Emblem and you've probably figured out what it is because we live in the 21st century and you have access to the internet. But uh, hey, do you know what Fire Emblem is? One time behind a cover, so your chance to hit is 50%. The other is out in the open, giving you 100% chance to hit. You can cycle targets with the left stick. Press A to shoot, select the target. Great. Let's do a Mordor. Who am I playing as? Mario right now. And you're dead. No, he's not dead. Oh, he is dead. Rip. I never finished Echoes? You still played Echoes. I didn't say finished. Kill him. Or shoot the cover. That's also fine. You can't do movement. Not allowed. Kill him dead, Peach. Peach Rabbit. Are you excited for six more FE fighters? Uh, not, not for me personally. But, no. Nah. I don't know. I'm excited to see what uh, comes next. Honestly, the Mii Fighter costumes are starting to get really exciting. Um, I like that Altair is there. Uh, I like that there's two Mega Mans instead of three. <laughs> Everybody being like, oh my god, they acknowledge Battle Network's existence, and I'm just sitting here like, hurt. <laughs> uh, they're all behind full cover, 0% chance of hitting, for them, and then you need to move so you can get a better thing. Got it. Time to do a move. Do we have any limitation on our move space? Not really? It's telling me to go here, so I'm gonna go... Oh, I guess I should go there. Can I share a thing? Go ahead. People want Sora would be another sword character. People want Dante who would use a sword half of the people. Well, that's why I want Rayman, personally. But I also want a Rayman in this game, so fuck me, I guess. <laughs> Even Ubisoft doesn't want to represent Rayman. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, if you changed all the Fire Emblem characters in fighting polygon style characters, how many could tell, could anyone tell apart? I don't know. Violet was my main pick. Yeah, I know. I can't even be mad because like my main pick, uh, I basically, uh, before I thought of Rayman, um, I basically had no picks, um, outside of, uh, Banjo and Kazooie. And Banjo and Kazooie's in there, so it's all gravy. I'm not upset about it, I don't even have a Switch. Uh, it just seems weird that they wouldn't do more variety, but I'm um, not really. I feel like, at this point, Fire Emblem characters getting in, I know it's like a meme, but I feel like they will always put in the main Fire Emblem character from whatever is currently relevant. And that's just going to continue. 
Um, like, they're always going to put it in, and, and it uh, is just going to happen. <sighs> they're not even the largest group of people in the game. Oh, hang on. Sorry, you redeemed a thing. The Streamlabs sucks, so hang on. Uh, please say I'm a Violeth main. I'm not, though, but okay. Hey, if you hate ASMR, turn away now. It's gonna happen. Hey, everybody. Hey, chat. So... You want me to say that I'm a Violeth main? My favorite characters in Smash Bros. are all the Fram Blam characters. I love all their swords and their anime titties and their tatas. Thank you. My name is Nick Dante. I usually one button swap. We did it. We learned how to play the video game. Whoa! It's Toy Story World from Sora Kingdom Hearts. I recognize those blocks in the basement. I hope they're more structurally sound after the super merge, but I doubt it. Okay. Hey, Linda. Hmm. <clears throat> And those bitches in the basement? What? What? I don't know what that means. I won't go this direction. Optional exploration. All right, is the game in an okay volume? I haven't really been looking at that. I meant to change my setup so that I can actually view that audio. <clears throat> yeah, it's good. Okay, thank you. I got a thing. Leafy World, you found an item. If you were somewhere, you could check it out. If only there were somewhere, you could check it out. <laughs> I was like, if you were somewhere, you could check it out. Like, huh. That's real existential of you, Mario game. Mario Ubisoft gun game. XCOM. I don't blink all the free Fire Emblem 3 DLC characters. Yeah. Ramblam has a history of making very attractive characters. Yeah, in the sky, see that? It began the moment the rabbits teleported into the Mushroom Kingdom. This is just Half-Life 2. This is just Half-Life 2 Episode 2, I think. Angie, we've seen floating upwards after a defeat an enemy, I wonder. All the more reason to catch the rabbit with the Super Mega headset. He's the key to stopping this, I'm sure of it. Okay. Everybody's horny for Shamir. If you're not horny for Shamir, you're a liar. You're lying to yourself and to the public. <clears throat> okay, I can't get that, I guess. <gasps> oh! Red coins. Red coins. Red coins. Red coins. Red coins? Red coins. Red coins. You did it. Just like in Mario. Why are they red, though? I don't know. They're made of blood. You found a new item, if only there's somewhere you can check it out. <sighs> only. That's not it. That's not the place where we can check it out. I want to go get those coins, even though I don't know what coins do yet. Hmm. You would smash? Why aren't they in Smash? So you can smash. <clears throat> Man, does anybody give two fricks about male Byleth? He seems like he's not even interested in the game he's in. He seems like he's constantly disassociating. <laughs> 
Isn't Dante in Smash now? No. What? I'm sure his voice actor is fine. It's just his expression is just like, Ugh. you know the problem that uh, Pokemon Sun and Moon had? I feel like that's the problem that <laughs> male Byleth had, where it's just like, hey, I have an expression, don't I? But good gameplay, play Fates. Play the 3DS video games. Cursor, you and I were just talking about how, like, anything on the 3DS is, like, there's no point anymore. <laughs> Even though we liked that handheld, we're just like, if it's on the 3DS, I don't know, fucking dead to me. What's a mess? Fire Emblem? Sorry, I'm having a hard time keeping up with chat because y'all are very energetic about Smash today. <clears throat> so apologize, apologies if I miss something. Mario. I found Mario. If only there was somewhere I could check it out. If only. Ah. You found yourself. Oh, that's a very deep personal journey that Mario just went on. Uh. So wait, does this mean that we're going through a rabid? A rabbit was fused with a tube, and we are literally going through them, and they're voring us. Because that's a whole thing I don't want to think about. You only like Fire Emblem because of the waifu stuff. Yeah, see, and like, I def like, the waifu stuff isn't my bag. Like, I would like the tactical combat stuff because, like, uh, I love Advance Wars. And Ramblam and Advance Wars have like really close ties. Um, but what are you gonna do? I'm not a big I'm not a big daddy sim boy. <clears throat> Guys, it's the Teen Titans Tower. Remember Teen Titans? Well, I guess they're still relevant. Teen Titans Go exists. In the earlier games, you got sports without the waifu stuff. Yeah, whatever. Each their own. I don't want to yuck anybody's yum. It's not necessary. Oh my god, look at these bees! Look at these bees, though. Look at them. Oh. 10 out of 10. Good vidja. Sorry, I'm just taking my time. Ex exploring. Getting lost. Doing nothing. Apologies. <clears throat> Whoops, all waifus. That's what they should call Framblam. Framblam, thank you, ma'am. Two! Oh, hi, Sunflower. <laughs> Greetings, sweet golden per perennial of the prairie. We are... Don't goop. Shoot your goo, my dude. Why did you do that? After that strange creature with the headset got here, those guys have been nothing but news. Man, I want to be a strange creature with a headset. That I can play Half-Life Alex when it comes out. <laughs> um, I assure you, these rabbits are not like their colleagues. Oh, well, if you can stop him, I'll happily reward you. He's zapping his brethren left and right, turns them real nasty. I don't suppose you would come with us to help. Yeah, I'm planted. Sorry, folks, but it's this. it's time this flower took things underground. All right, bye. <laughs> <clears throat> Old Framblams. Uh, stressful and not newbie friendly. No, for sure. Um, because it has permadeath. And that's definitely stressful. Um, Fire Emblem Awakening was the first one to add, uh, non-permadeath, right? And I played a lot of Awakening. Like, I gave that game, like, a super honest shot. The story was not for me. What? Yeah, yes? Wasn't there a cannon back here I didn't go through? Hey, cool guy. 
What video game ghost character best resembles Viz? Uh, literally Flint Hook. Literally, go look at the main character of Flint Hook. Uh, from the game Flint Hook. Uh, it's, it's literally 100% what made me change all my branding. Uh, because previously my, uh, branding was just a chameleon. Because it's really hard to represent invisibility as a visual idea. Um, and so I was like, ah, chameleons, like, they do camouflage. Everybody kind of, like, acknowledges that. So, that's a thing. And then, uh, and I just don't like traditional ghosts as, like, a... Like, I don't hate them. I just don't think that uh, a traditional ghost with just, like, it's a round thing with a, like, a sheet ghost kind of deal. It's very typical. Um, and I don't think I could do anything interesting with that. And so I didn't, like, make my mascot a ghost or anything. And then I played Flint Hook, and I was like, oh, this could be a thing. <sighs> Naps to Bluke is depressed at your uh, dislike. Let's see where Naps to Bluke is. Naps to Bluke is on his way to my home. Um, and he's in my country, but I don't think we've gotten any specifics about where he is. Oh, best resembles? Well, resemblance means means visual to me. I don't know, personality? I couldn't tell you. I don't know enough ghosts. Johnny the Ghost. I figured it out. It's Johnny the Ghost. He's a wise crack and trumpet playing friend. That one was for Chrisu. Well, last update was it departed from Vancouver, Canada. It's broken for now, though. Considering how dangerous it is, I have a hard time believing the rabbits won't fix it. Okay. <laughs> you don't live in an attic, no. See you, Royal. Enjoy your lunch. Hey, Noel. Uh, what does Viz look like? Maybe we'll find out someday. Dear, Be uh, dear Bebo, this, if one is to prevail, one must practice. Please sharpen your movement skills so you can turn tables on. Actually, I've uploaded a few suggestions to help guide your team in the next battle. Quick. Biggest fan. Oh, BF. Wait, FB? Fan big? Biggest fan. <clears throat> you can deal damage while on the move by performing a dash. Uh, select cell enemies if you can cover more ground with a team jump. Select cell with an ally and press A. How about an epic combo? After you dash an enemy, perform a team jump with an ally. Okay, so luckily I have watched gameplay of this game. So... Um... I can actually just... Oh, I can switch. It's not a turn order. I can just choose who goes first. Okay, cool. Uh, uh, hang on. Go here. And then... And then... What if I move you here? Ah, fuck. Can I undo? Shit. I've made a mistake. <clears throat> Vizzo is a cutie. Linda actually briefly saw what I looked like because I made a big oopsie back in the Skype days. Rick. Hey, Dymart. We've been going for 35 minutes. Not much has happened. Rick, I really fucked that up. Ah, hoomst. Hi, Mark. Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the ghost zone. Big oopsie, it's true. I actually posted a selfie in the old Skype days. Kablamo. Inviso is unconfirmed cutie. Oh, we can't hit them because zero percent. <laughs> Fucking Luigi, Luigi Rabbit just sitting out there in the open like, Duh. yeah, it's fine. Ow! Hey, don't do that. Rude as heck. I'll do it. Well. Luigi Mario 
Luigi Rabbit is uh, gonna draw all the aggro. Heroes. Hmm. Oh, I can rotate the camera. Thank God. One of my biggest issues with like a lot of tactical games is um being able to um. For some reason, I thought you could do damage with this move. I don't know why I thought that. Hey, Mario. Well, might as well springboard off someone. I don't know. Uh, here we go. Woo! Dang it. <clears throat> with Mario, you can believe. I can believe in something. <sighs> You still contain, contain salt from yesterday. What happened yesterday that contains salt? Can I just, like, go on the other side of this cover and shoot at you there? That's probably ill-advised. Yeah. Let's go behind here. <clears throat> Viz is confirmed. Ooh, woo. No confirmation. Oh, God. Luigi, Luigi Rabbit is having a rough go. Luigi, <laughs> Luigi Rabbit is getting bullied real hard. No, don't shoot Mario. Bamboozled from your PayPal. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, Vigenta wants to know my name, which I will not give up willingly. I think if you commission me, uh, you learn my name. That's not like a, oh, hey, you should commission me. Thank you, Linda. So, if I do this, is, does that, like, end my turn there? Oh, wait, he dies. So, got it, got it, got it, got it. Okay. Noted. And you can only do one of those per thingy. Got it. Learning things. Your name isn't Inviso? No, but in Japanese JRPGs, my name is Viso God. Did I start saying that one of my biggest problems with tactics games is that uh, if you can't rotate the camera? Did I finish that thought? I feel like I didn't finish that thought. Perfect, huh? It didn't feel like it, I gotta say. <laughs> oh, I rotated the cam- oh. Oh, I can rotate the camera all sorts of ways. Now I'm gonna get super lost. Super lost. <laughs> <clears throat> Also, congrats on your oof, uh, emote, Kurt. That's a good one. <laughs> like that it has the thinking modification. Very good. I can confirm that if you commission Vizzo, his Gmail has his full name. Yeah, I'm working on a commission post, y'all, so stay tuned. Uh, I'm gonna update my prices, though. Um, but... Back when I was considering uh, redoing my prices, uh, I was feeling really good about my art, and now I don't. So I'm like, hmm, maybe I'll just leave them the same. Rabbit Peach, you found a new item. If only there was some way to view it. We found Rabbit Peach. He's very angry. Dang it! There's coins over there. Let's go back. My entire being burns with the want to learn Viz's name because I'm a nosy whore. Eh. It's not that exciting. My name isn't like Estevan Von Fluker. I don't know. That'd be cool though. Uh... <clears throat> I think <laughs> I think Royal Blue went for lunch. So I don't know that they're able to respond at this current moment out of the shadows. Also, hey shadows. Sorry if I didn't say hello. <clears throat> Be a perfect if no one dies. Got it. That's my definition of perfect. It's time to pull together everything you've learned so far. Attack, movement, team jump, dash. I haven't learned very much about the team jump. Uh, don't forget about cover. You can also switch heroes anytime using L and R and attack. But oh my god, why is it flashing like that? Uh, yeah. 
Okay. There's a bunch of boys over that way. Whoops! I didn't mean to shoot that boy. I meant to shoot other boys. You know, the boys that are, like, presently endangering us. <clears throat> I'm not sure how long we're going to play this for. TBH. Uh, kill this one. I think it may be a couple hours. Depending on if I'm still jazz better. Oh, wow. I sure haven't healed from that last fight. And then we're going to go over to uh, Rayman 2, which I'm having a friggin' heckin' lot of fun with. The game's super good. No! Oh. Don't shoot at my boy. I think my only issue, like, this game is gorgeous. I think my only issue with it is that everything looks plastic. Like, the character models have, like, this weird sheen to them. Like, Mario looks, like, kind of shiny, you know? And it's not really an issue, it's, like, a tiny gripe. You know? Hmm. Oh, whoops. I didn't want to attack that guy, actually. Well, worked out okay. Oh, no, I can't actually reach the, the boy. Get full cover, I guess. Can you just... Is your range, like, functionally unlimited in this game? You can shoot anywhere, as long as you've got line of sight. We did it. <gasps> we got healed, thank goodness. Not quite? Okay. Wow. There is a limit. Stay within it. Hey, Sunflower. Mario, the creature with the heads that got away, but I suppose you did clean up his best. Be a play to my word, it looks like I owe you a reward. Our good friends Rabbit Luigi and Rabbit Peach helped us as well. Yeah, yeah, great. Thanks for the coin. Dude, that's rude. Oh, what the heck? -y? Don't stone people who give you things. It's not nice. Okay, okay, here. <clears throat> Regurgitate something else. It's a chest. Maybe more than one coin. It has a, a a box from Blender. It can go on a Z, Y, and X axis. <clears throat> oh, you know what? It actually probably is a 3D model that you can just look at. Now that I think about it. I want that. I want that real bad. You actually hate the rabbits? Yeah. I don't... I don't love them. You haven't learned how to do this yet. Okay. Um, I don't love them because... Whatever. Like, they're this thing that became extraordinarily popular. Uh, and it was a spinoff. It's like the Spyro Skylanders thing, you know? Um, Rabbids were originally a Rayman enemy, and then they spun off into, like, 50,000 games of their own, and now they are, like, a, the Ubisoft mascot, which isn't bad, it's just, it makes me wish that Rayman was that. <clears throat> you know? Uh, now you can beat them up in Smash to your heart's desire, it's true, you can dress up a Mii Fighter in a Rabbids costume and then beat him up. 
They're a Mii Fighter costume in Smash, yeah. Ubisoft got two costumes today. Are those out? Are the costumes out today? I know the DLC fighter isn't out, but are the Mii Fighter costumes out? Thank goodness you're here, you're... Oh, wait. Uh... I'm trying to remember. Okay, Mario, thank goodness you're here. Yours is the first friendly face I've seen since Mushroom Kingdom turned into this mess. Your timing couldn't be more perfect. I can't find Toadette. Things the changes caused by these odd pipes our rabid friends brought with them into your world. You guys seem to know what you're doing, sort of. Could you help me find her, please? Okay, you're gonna see firsthand how big of a pain these pipes are. Okay. Let's go. Maybe, but they look so cool. We'll be quiet. Do we have Toad in our party now? <gasps> Is good. That's how you do Toad. No, I I choose to ignore uh, present Toad voice. I I I put it out of my mind. I think N64 era Toad for a Toad voice. The one that's all like wow 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 and all game and all that stuff instead of blah, blah. you know that kind of stuff. Why is this one blue? Why are you blue? Why do you look like you're from Tron from Kingdom Hearts 2? Oh, okay. It's a stage trip. Oh. Uh. Oh my god, I'm really fast. I have a limited amount of time. I hate this. I'm scared. We did it. <clears throat> Super show of all things? Probably? I don't know. I never watched Super Show, so I don't know like when the the voice acting and stuff lined up. Oh, you found a new item. If only there were some where you could check it out. I don't know. This is basically what he sound like? Hmm. Okay. Gotcha. Kind of became minions, knockoffs, which were basically servbots, knockoffs. Well, that's charming. Servbots are amazing. Servbots are so good. Servbots are not to be compared to minions. I mean, they're literally like minions, but they're cute and not irritating, you know? Like, rabbits and uh, minions as a concept are like these irritating, annoying creatures, and that's like their whole shtick. It's like, haha, funny. But uh, servbots are just kind of like dumb little robots. And it's even weirder because uh, the Super Show is from way before the N64. Yeah, I don't know. Hello, we found her. That wasn't too tough. I'm really worried about his Princess Peach. Is it because you turn into her someday? And will cause a lot of questions on the internet? Go back to and make sure everything's all right? Sure. We need to find the thing. We got an email. Another message. Congratulations on getting this far. A wise man once said, if I have three hours to chop a tree, I will spend two of them sharpening my axe. I urge you now to return to Princess Peach's castle and do just that. Prepare yourselves for the fight to come. Well, it's all well and good, but how? Uh, you may be wondering how. In the time it took you to read this email, I've updated your operating system. It now includes a GPS warp mechanism I call Sploing. Oh, that's fun. The name is a work in progress. No, the name is great. Anyhow, simply activate it and your friends will return to Princess Peach's castle immediately. Signed, your biggest fan. Well, that's amazing if true. I suppose I should give it a... Well. Yeah, I also thought Facebook. Ask enemies whenever possible. It's like having an extra attack. Change your team's line. Oh, okay. There's just a Goomba stuck to the side of the castle. Oh, no. Hey, Peach. I'm glad you're okay. Oh, you think heavens are alright. It's good to see you. Uh, I probably noticed this, but the Mushroom King has been torn apart. You have to do something, Mario. Oh, um, who are your new friends? Eh. Excuse me. <clears throat> uh, me, your highness. I am Beepo, an autonomous intelligence scientific research and operational assistant. I see, and we call this one Rabid Luigi, and this one Rabid Peach. 
Er, <laughs> she's taking her cosplay a bit too seriously, I'm afraid. <laughs> Not impressed. They're going to go make Mario Maker 2. Yes, their friends are also quite er, spirited, as you can see. Wait, that was Peach, I think. Uh, it appears as if rabbits we freed from the Mega Bugs control have ended up here, and no worse for wear either. That's right, they keep on popping up in just like you do. Oh. Well, they're very dedicated to this building thing. There's a lot happening in the scene. Yes, they've been quite busy. I suggest you take a look at what they've built, uh, if you have a chance. Okay. And, oh. Oh, I believe something called the Battle HQ? Whoa. And there's the museum. They love to collect souvenirs from the Mushroom Kingdom. Right, that's where our 3D models are, probably. <clears throat> okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Look at that Goomba up there. Somebody help him. Help him. <laughs> Ancient garden. Oh my god, Mario does his Naruto run. I can't believe it. Rabbo Rabbo something. Pixel pack unlocked. Wow. Vintage pixelated and pixel. Those are voxels. You can't fool me. I know. Uh, steampunk pack unlocked. I'm gonna style your Metro. The steampunk pack weapons are available for use. That's Suichi. That's another rabid. That's a peach. That's a Yoshi rabbit, and that's Yoshi. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, area of movement, four cells. Yeah, 20 damage. Four blaster, blaster. Okay, they're all identical. Except for Luigi. Rabbit. Weapon selection. Ooh. Bounce damage. Bounce chance. Honey chance against Ziggy's, 20% damage, honey damage. Ah, dang, those are some good damage numbers. Wow. This is a very powerful thing. I feel like we'll be able to coast through the video game with that. Let's give one person... Wait, I didn't get to choose who equips it. Does it just apply to everyone? Like what? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm going to do something, but Viz is going to hate me for it. Oh, wait. Maybe... Oh, I see. Oh, everybody has specific items. Okay, okay. That wasn't super clear to me. So this is all Mario's items. 2 to 35. This one is the best. This weapon looks very cool. I like its color scheme. This weapon is objectively better. It looks like it's from uh, Heart and Slash. <clears throat> um... You're our elemental. Push chance against Ziggy's. Push chance. Cover damage low. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> Burn chance is pretty good. Let's do. Let's do the one that has the chance to burn people.
Oh, wow, I just spent a lot of money. I should have not done that. Mistakes were made. I'm not gonna do that, Vigenta. This is 420. Happy 420, everybody. Hang on. Oh my god. I wish the scroll wheel on my mouse wasn't the worst. Uh, trying to figure out what's going on. You used to be able to... I think you can refund rewards? Um, did I miss a good ASMR? No. Okay, hey, well, if somebody provides me with the B-movie script, I guess I'll do it. But if it's long, I'm gonna be like, no thank you. I don't, like, I don't have that memorized. <laughs> somebody has to do a copy-paste, please, and thank you. Naruto, you weeb-ass. I mean, <laughs> Naruto, Mario, you weeb-ass, weeb. Also, I spiny shell. We must find a way to restore it, and then spend the rest of our time trying to avoid it. Okay, that sounds great. Sounds like a good time. <laughs> this is under construction. Not so thrilled with the rabbit's work thus far. Let's hope this little project of theirs is more constructive. Maybe that's DLC? I don't know. <sighs> okay. If you don't like ASMR or the B movie, both of which I'm not a fan of, uh, turn your ears off. I wish I could. It's it's happening. According to all known laws of aviation, there is no way a bee should be able to fly. Its wings are too small to get its fat little body off of the ground. The bee, of course, flies anyway. Because bees don't care what humans think is pos impossible. Blech. Ugh. Hey, Johnny, honey. <clears throat> Banan- bananas? I see a banana. What's going on? Oh, right. Let's check out the 3D model viewing room. Yep, that's correct. Okay. Well, that was about what I expected. Oh, that's very pretty. That concept art? That. Each looks like a 3D model, but everything else looks like it's drawn. Very good. Well, thank you, gallery. Aha, look over there! Whoa! It's a very angry thing, and then it was happy. These clever rabbits have outfitted a cannon so that it can launch us back to ancient gardens. This comes in handy as our mysterious helper gave me the power to warp to Princess Peach's castle. And the cannons can send us back to the front. The ability to return to Princess Peach's castle at will uh, has even been added to the pause menu. Great. I love it. I love returning to places. Thank you, Viz. No problem. I reserve the right to refuse ASMR requests, depending on their content. Uh, combo watch from a time machine, else I take a trip to the French Baroque period. Is like the the washing time machine thing like canon to the end of a rabbits game that I'm not familiar with do the next paragraph please please stop I don't want to if you're going to if you're going to request something for me to read please provide the thing to read in the future you don't understand to check it out in the museum no I can't I'm sorry that I'm being a sour 
boy about the B movie script, but I just I'm not in on that meme. I don't like it. It's not fun for me. I hope it's fun for you guys. I mean, again, just give me the script. I'll do it, but just in the future, just get the scripts first before you request it. Because I ain't looking it up. The B-movie script with the backwards? Please don't. I feel like there's a lot of exploration in this game that's an XCOM video game. Whoa! <gasps> Look at that pumpkin! Pumpkin. It's very good. Is this a battle? Is this a kingdom death battle? Good thing I don't see myself, but if I did, I'd probably dream about intelligent machines taking over the world. I'm very happy to hear that. Well, at these gates, we could visit this haunted slum of unimaginable horrors anytime we wanted. Great. I haven't learned how to do this yet. Read? Okay. Uh, Linda has also redeemed a thing and helpfully provided text. Uh, please do the cute quote from a movement novel. I need to increase the redemption price of ASMR quotes. That is a thing that I need to do. <clears throat> Got a new 3D model. It's Toadette. Wow, I can't wait to not look at them. I'm really excited about that not looking thing. Please don't throw what I live for. No, the price is gonna go up. My only, th my only big beef with it is that it frequently like interrupts like stream like it, it it puts a hitch in like what we're currently doing you know like it forces me to stop and be like hey i need to do a thing you know but like that's that's probably my main thing like in on an art stream i don't care but like with gameplay streams i'm usually like ah, i kind of want to be focused on doing the video game sort of deal like that's not anybody's fault that's that's my fault <laughs> i put the thing in there I'm sorry if I'm coming across like I'm attacking people for redeeming the thing that I put in there. Which isn't really a fair thing to do. Um, so, apologies for that. But, uh, anyway, I guess I'll read that thing. So if you hate ASMR, turn your ears off, turn away. Eh, but art streams are not regular enough, Agenta. Um, <clears throat> um, okay. If you don't like ASMR, turn away now. It's gonna happen. Uh, Okay. And uh, redeemed uh, channel points to request that I read a cute quote from the movement novel. One by one, the snowflakes floated down to his warm snout and melted. He reached out to grab them so he could admire them for a fleeting moment. He looked towards the sky and watched them drift downwards toward him. Down toward him is what it said there. More and more soft and light as a feather. So that's how it works, thought Moomin Troll. And I thought somehow that the snow grew from the ground up. Moomin Lamb Midwinter. Ugh. It's really hard to read when my microphone is right in my face because I essentially have to look around the microphone and cross my eyes. It's tough. Um... Thank you, Visit. No problem, Linda. <clears throat> Make it more special? I guess. I guess. Okay, you can turn your ears back on. Rabbits. I wonder how long they've been at it. We may never know. I haven't learned to do that. Alright, I can rotate the camera. I kind of forgot. No, I can't. I lied. I lied about the camera thing. A bee! A bee. Whose blood do you think the coins are made of? Mm, where's the last one? Where's the last one, though? Oh, no. 
I'm glad they're not timed. <laughs> We got a thing. Wah! Like Van Gogh, rabbits often practice their craft with tortured tributes of themselves. Great. That's fun. <clears throat> uh, do you have a Roomba? Uh, are you asking Invisible Guy in real life if he has a Roomba? Because you'd know. Definitely not. How goes Mario and has rabies? Uh, it's going okay. We've had a lot of ASMR redemptions, which reminds me that I need to change the price of those. Um, I'm having fun. We haven't done that many battles, honestly. It's been a lot of just Roomba-ing around. In the game, is that a Roomba? It's definitely Roomba-esque. But well, you can't call it a Roomba. It's it's. We learned that it's a copyrighted term. You need to call it a vacuum circle. Legally distinct vacuum circle. <laughs> Please eat the Roomba. <sighs> I can't. I can't do that. Hello. Oh, he's springy. Boing. Boing. Boing, boing. Hopper. Team jumping jerks. Heck, a new breed of hopping enemies. Team jump will prove invaluable here. Use it to gain the upper hand. I'll do my best. What's this? Our pseudonym sympathizer just sent me a system update. From now, before combat begins, uh, you can choose whether to leap headlong into the he heat of battle or take time to carefully plan your strategy first. Thanks to this new app called Er Tacticam. What is. Okay. <clears throat> okay. So it's just to be like, hey, you can go this far. Got it. shoot him. I didn't think you could reach him from here with your yo-yo. It burned him! Wow, burning seems very useful. Holy heck, it just makes them run around and expose themselves. But like in a good way. Not in like a you're gonna get on a watch list kind of way. Shoot him with the pixel gun. Now he's honeyed, but he's also dead. Wow, these DLC weapons are going to just put us on easy street, huh? Okay. Whoops. Can I go back? I'll admit, I kind of am surprised that this game that's pretty user-friendly and meant to be, like, a pretty... Uh, I mean, I'm sure it gets way more difficult early. Or, uh, not early. Uh, later on. Um, for sure. But I'm surprised that there's not a move undo button. Dox them. Please no, please no dox. No, oh, my cover. Heroes. Uh, let's go back down. Hmm. <laughs> <clears throat> Can I jump after? I can! I can just go down there for free and come back up. Oof. Boink. And now I can shoot this man. He got honeyed. Now he can't move. And he's dead, also. Uh, it's coming from those trumpet flowers. It means the music is... Diegetic? 
Oh my god, they I didn't notice that. That's so cute. them not you the rabbits mm, I don't know I think you were talking about me we got honey criticals golden shot that's somebody's fetish let's move up let's no shoot Luigi rabbit do I have to oh I can just get them for free. Okay, I was like, am I gonna have to collect these with a player character? Not a player character, but you know what I mean. I'm so I'm a someone. Wait, I forgot what I said already. Surprising nobody. Can I jump onto him? No. Let me change to you. And you can do this. And then, can you just come back up here? No. <clears throat> that's <laughs> that's someone's fetish. Okay, sorry. Man, I probably should, like my doctor asked about my memory. Um, when I went in to like uh, check and be like, hey, how's the antidepressants going? And he's like, is your memory good? And I was like, no, it's not great, but it wasn't good before. It's really bad. I'll bring that up the next time I go. <laughs> What's someone's fetish? Uh, doxing people. No, honeying someone. Covering honey. It's covering someone in honey. Boop, boop, boop. That's a big Goomba. On the plus side, his backside has got to be extremely clean by now. Oh, it's like a natural bidet. Look at him go. I'm sure he's jazzed. <clears throat> also, Vizzo has definitely said that to me sometime. Golden shot? Mmm. -hmm. The way this area seems quiet, but many sensors detect the presence of lots of hidden enemies. It'll be impossible to defeat them all. Let's focus on reaching the safe zone at the end of the battlefield. As long as one of us reaches the safe zone, we win. So don't, don't, don't fight the enemy. So we need to get all the way here. Well, there's only three of them. We can take them. Easy peasy. Where does this go? Over here. Over here. Okay. But don't go over here through the front because that's dumb. Go this way. <clears throat> I did a dumb. Uh, the in canon name for a genre of music, the Star Wars Cantina <laughs> band plays is jizz. I feel like I knew that. I don't like that I knew that, but I feel like I knew that. <laughs> Gross. Uh, full cover? Can I shoot them from here? Why'd I do that? There's no reason. Thanks, I hate it. It's true. Hmm. What's your plan, enemies? Running away? I see how it is. Cowards. Oh well. Oh. Okay. I see I see the I see the troubles.
Oh, I can hit them from here. No, well, not technically. I can try and hit them, but not actually succeed. Here, here I go. And I spring off of you. Springer. <clears throat> You guys ever have a tag on your sweatpants that just like really irritates your bum? I got that going on right now. I know, I know. Thank you for asking. I'm really glad you all asked about my bum tag. I really appreciate you guys inquiring about my bum um, situation. I know you are all you were all curious. Kill him dead. Oh my god, I killed him dead. Rip. <clears throat> As that bum tag viz, it's irritating. I should honestly cut it off. Which generally doesn't help most cases, but I feel like it would. Uh, can I shoot and then move? Is that an option? Because I know in, like, Final Fantasy Tactics, you have to... Okay, good. You can. Uh, Mario, you should probably stay there so that the next boy can spling off of you. Like this. You missed! How dare you! <laughs> Cut off your bum? No. I need to have something. I got nothing else going for me. Uh, my bum isn't great, though. But it could be potentially. Never helps. Can you receive a hug? Uh, no, it's not a redemption thing that I've added to my channel yet. Hugs are not, uh, available for free. <laughs> I mean, sure. You can have a hug. I like hugs. They're neat. <clears throat> oh, this is a cute emote. Oomst. Nega hug. It's the anti-hug. <laughs> Look at that. That rabbit's face reminded me so much of, like, dogs. Like, really derpy pup... Not puppies, but, like, uh... I'm thinking, like, chihuahuas just making faces. <clears throat> you know the ones. Can I hit him? New. No. No sir, no siree. Stop crawling out of the G-dang ground. This isn't overland. That's a lot of emotes. Hey, I made those. <clears throat> Don't guard the, the thing. Don't guard the thing like that. I need to get there. Fucking rude boy. Can't get there yet. I guess I'll just hide here and you at very close range, and hopefully not miss, because I think it still counts as half cover, right? Wow! <laughs> we, we, we both got lit on fire? And victory conditions were achieved <laughs> through friendly fire. Fantastic. I'm gonna go take out the trash. Uh, be back in a while. Okay. You sure did technically win that fight. No one can say that you didn't. Got my new glasses, and the prism implants are giving me a headache. Oh, no. I don't know what that means. That sounds very... Um... Complex. Never had glasses. Although I might need them with, like, the amount that I look at screens. Honestly, I can probably... I should probably see an optometrist about me eyeballs. <clears throat> Prison implants? Yeah. 
You ever get, you know, that prison, that tiny little micro prison implanted in your glasses? It's to, it's to, it's to subsidize the cost of uh, private prisons in America. They can store them in your glasses so that they don't have to uh, build on new ground. It is vital that we stop that rabbit who integrated himself with the super merge before he creates more atrocities. We got email, though. Uh, I received another message from our mysterious friend. Let me read it to you. Congratulations, Beepo. You have successfully led your party through trials and tr tra travails worthy of Odysseus himself. Finally, someone gives me credit I'm due. This, of course, is mainly due to Mario and your rabbit friends, whose skill in battle you vastly underestimated. Aw. Yes, well, him. <clears throat> Though, as with Odysseus, there are rougher waters ahead. Therefore, I feel time has come to bestow upon you some new tools for your arsenal. <gasps> wow. We got cards. Henceforth, in addition to being able to move and fire upon your adversaries, you will each be able to perform one other action during the natural course of combat. Uh, to Mario, I give... Given the gift of hero sight, when activated, he will be able to strike at foes within range even outside the normal succession of events. Uh, so that's like Overwatch. For Rabbit Peach, I give the gift of shield. When used, it will ward against most weapon damage. Congrats. Oh, it's a Steven universe. For Rabbit Luigi, I grant Super Barrier. Attacks against enemy super effects and can also reduce damage. It's green Steven universe. As for t uh, how to most effectively use your new gifts, I leave that to you to discover for yourselves. More gifts will come in the future, I hope. With anticipation, your biggest fan. Hooray! Aha! Our incognito ally's ability to give us exactly what we need at exactly the right time is uncanny. Remind me not to play them at Go Fish. Go Fish. That's a game I haven't played in a hot minute. When was the last time you guys played Go Fish? Last time I can remember was like many, many years ago. I think I was in high school and uh, we went to the cottage and uh, my uncle was drunk and we were trying to explain Go Fish to him and he was being a an idiot. <clears throat> Check out those suspicious covers. They have the same super effect symbol most weapons have. They look ready to explode or something. Let's avoid using weapons within close proximity to them. Listen, we're not worried about weapons in close proximity we blew ourselves up with the thing uh you can move over here oh i see the steel ones won't break that's something i should have thought about uh is this just free like can i just use this at the end of a turn and it's just like oh you just get that forever um you can go here i guess Doom dead. No, oh, that's not dead. Activate the thing, I guess. Yeah. Yahoo! Whippy! Yaha! And so I think Mario's thing is if enemies uh, come within range of him. Mario time! Uh, they will be shot. I think? Oh no, he's flanking us. I didn't see that. Yeah, there you go. A blowy. And he's dead. And he's dead. No, he's not. Heck. Ow, dude. Did you guys ever slide tackle people in school? That was a big old staple of my elementary school. Was while somebody was talking to somebody else, just slide tackling them. Of course, this resulted with them falling on top of you, basically. So it wasn't ideal for anybody involved, but it was fun. You should probably. Uh. Hmm. <clears throat> Oof! Holy shit! There's ring out mechanics? In this game? That's noteworthy. Wait. I probably shouldn't have attacked the guy that has 100% cover. That was stupid. 
You silly, silly person. Uh... Let's just hope we don't hurt ourselves. So, can we hurt ourselves with any weapon if we shoot from this close? No. Fire seems to be the thing. Oh, I didn't realize how almost dead that guy was. I probably should have focused him. And now he's out of here. <laughs> oh, my body. My tangible human body. Or... Mushroom Kingdonian body. So this, when's Invisocon <laughs> where we all cuddle? Uh, uh, I don't know. Not soon. Not very soon times. I can tell you that faux show. Uh, this is less than ideal. Hmm. Hmm. Here we go. Heck him up. <clears throat> but not never. Not never. And I don't think Inviso CuddleCon is going to have open invites. I think I think tickets are going to be pretty limited and pretty exclusive to people that I know. <laughs> In the real world, maybe. Or have met before. Me? Sure. Linda gets an invite. <coughs> Veeam's CuddleCon. Guess Linda plays Veeam's home. Wow. <laughs> That's a very exclusive con. No... No. There probably be other people. Oh, it's not free. It has a cooldown. I see. You don't want to just use it whenever. You want to use it when it's going to be advantageous. It's because I sent Vizu a Christmas card. That's that's probably it. He just got to send me a Christmas card. And Linda was the only one who did that this year, so <laughs> she gets an invite. That's all it takes. <clears throat> ah. Strange, though it looks like there are only two of those rabid mark covers, my senses detect four of them. Watch out, they may be disguised as normal covers. I'm confused with that. Oh! So the explodey thingies are potentially like regular cover. So I assume. I also assume that they're not waist high cover. Because we've only seen them as like boxes. Yeah, it's gonna be a pretty. It's gonna be a pretty exclusive time to be alive. Um, listen, in general, I don't cuddle my friends in real life right now. So like, chances of chances of cuddling with folks is very, very, very minimal in general. Hey, Dan. Welcome. We're just talking about Inviso CuddleCon. And when it is. <clears throat> and who gets invites? <clears throat> sure, cuddle my online friends. Yeah, that's valid. That's true. I feel that. 
No, don't shoot me. Oh, you shot me. I asked you to not do that. Yeah, those big old blocks stand out. <laughs> don't shoot. Oh, no. No cover. I have like one IRL friend that I would cuddle. Everyone else I cu I'd cuddled are uh, online friends. <clears throat> That's valid. Yeah, I don't know. My my IRL friends I don't think would be down. I don't think they'd be game for that. Oh, hey, maybe, hang on. Let me just do a shoot bang against this guy real quick. Uh, wow. Uh, let's hide behind. Uh, how far can I go if I go back here? Not far enough. Can I go back through? Oh, I can come back through. Oh my goodness. This seems dangerous. I don't want to go there. What if I just... Mm. And also, I live on the other side of the ocean, which I'm personally offended by. <laughs> I'm geographically offended by these conditions. Uh, let's put your thing on. Because that box might explode. <clears throat> Whoa. I can go all the way back here? What the heck? Oh, it might be these boxes, too. No, it's probably these boxes. Wow. There's sorts of options. Oh, yeah! Dan Jones, did you kill the ocean last night? I think I went to bed before you killed the ocean. I sure did. I sure did murder that ocean. That ocean will think twice before producing all life on the planet. <laughs> I don't love that these the implication of these rabid tubes being living creatures. Or having previously been living creatures. It's not my favorite thing to think about. Uh... 60% chance to honey. Might as well kill one. Golden shots. I'm glad you're getting... I'm glad you're enjoying those golden shots. Uh, let's put your shield thing on, because I'm not convinced that this isn't a giant explosion box. Getting bored in both ends. Yup. Maybe I can finally meet my friends. If the ocean weren't there, you just drive across. It's still a pretty long drive. Still a pretty big drive. Excuse you, sir. Hang on, let me attack you first. Oh, whoa. Ooh, woo, oh, whoa. What dis, etc. <clears throat> sure. Activate hero sight. Uh oh. Please don't run into me. Oh, he's dead. Did we win? Hey! Activate your eyeballs. Activate your eyes, chat. Good thing to do. It's important to use your eyeballs whenever prompted. Oh, 
That duck has a cool choker on. So many questions here. Perhaps they're better left unanswered. Gotcha. Be one of those. Man, is one of... You know these types of things? I think Zelda has one, right? In the Fire Temple or something? Where, like, walls only show up when you get close to them? It's like a maze situation? Um... <laughs> Rabbits are horrible, but I like this game. Yeah. I get it. I super get it. Um... One of the worst versions of this is definitely in Dream Drop Distance. Or not Dream Drop Distance, sorry. Uh, Birth by Sleep. Like, I really love Birth by Sleep. Birth by Sleep is probably my favorite Kingdom Hearts game overall. Um, but holy fuck. The, the maze puzzle in, I think it's the Sleeping Beauty World? In a gigantic room that also has teleporting pads? That's a, that's a piranha lamp. Fun. I think we're out of options. I don't think we can do anything. More fun than I assumed it would be? Yeah. It's really chill. Um, to be honest. Talk about the life of the party. It's not just wearing a lampshade. It's wearing a whole lamp. Good for it. You know? They deserve a win. <laughs> Bunny lamp or bamp. Hmm. No, I want that red thing. No. 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 Oh. I'm really glad these aren't timed. Regular coin. Wait, that's progress. Goodbye. No, oh, thank you. It's been fun. Goodbye. Bunnies are very cute. It's amazing how not cute rabbits are. I think it's about their mouth thing. Oh, they are timed. <gasps> no. Frick. I was under the impression there was no time limit. Now I feel like the fool. Um... It's about their Homer Simpson, like, uh, five o'clock shadow mouth situation, you know? Not a gigantic fan of that. Any back here? No. I mean, like, they did something right, because they're incredibly popular. But, like, minions are too, so I don't know. Make irritating cartoon character. Oh, I failed. Again. We got a 3D model. Wow. I almost wish I hadn't bothered. <laughs> I'm Boo Boo the Fool? I don't know what that is. What's that? Is that a cute bunny? I want a bun bun. The big sad. Bunnies are so heckin' cute. Um, buns are good. Maybe someday you'll get a bun, Linda. I feel like you are a good pet owner, from what I know of your experiences with your, your gog. Your little gog. So I'm sure you could definitely be a real good bun owner. I also want another gog. So many little gog, so many little things. No. No. Don't want to fail. No. Is this is this is this fun to watch everybody? Are we having fun yet?
in a sea of gog uh if linda feels like sharing and has like pictures that she'd want to post in the discord or here like by all means i welcome them no no oh thank goodness i gotta navigate back to the middle this is a horrible reward <laughs> Better be the best gun cannon arm in the game. I don't know what it is. <laughs> Rainbow Runner. Ooh. That guy trouble melts uh, like lemon drops and dreams of butt kicking. Really do come true over this rainbow. Um, Is it okay to link an insta pick? Yeah, go for it. You're fine. Do it. They don't turn it. Oh, it's the it's the Pokemon end of Pokemon movie. Brother, my brother, tell me what are we fighting? But we got and big bow. Wow, one coin. Oh, many coins. I'm going to look at this Gog as well. Gog! Oh. So good. Ugh. Good Gog. He was the goodest Gog. <clears throat> Here's one. Now I'm done. One more. Now I'm done. Oh, she bite. <laughs> Was a dog or a hog, as in pig, but this is better. Yeah, hedgehog. So the, the, the story that that comes from is my sister's friend. When he was like a baby, he loved hedgehogs, but he couldn't say the words, so he just called them gogs. Um, and that has caught on in my group of friends as well. Brother, where art thou? <gasps> Louis, Luigi? Defeat all. I noticed you are not calling them enemies. This time we are on higher ground compared to our enemies. Did you know that you gain a damage bonus when you attack from above? Fire upon an enemy from this vantage point and see for yourself. Okay. Hmm. Excuse me. It's finish. Yee. I know one finish word, and it's a swear. Uh, 50%, 30%. Let's do this guy. Critical. Yeah, that one. Perkele. That one. I can't, I can't do. I did a whoopsie. I'm so <laughs> proud to have taught you that. Do I know how to swear the, uh, say the finish swear good? Have I improved? Yes, I'm glad. <clears throat> Uh, activate the enemy, the hero site. Activate your eyeballs, Mario. Put them on. Oh, right. He can't attack. No, don't destroy our cover. Oh, no. I didn't see that man. No, don't attack my Mario. No. Wait, why didn't your hero site activate? Oh, you shot another guy when I wasn't paying attention. Oh, they can also do the Sproinger. Heroes. 
A term we use very loosely. Eh. Yeah, I might as well kill this one. Fuck. Well. Sure did not do that. Great. <clears throat> no, this is a bad idea. This is a really bad idea. Uh, yeah, activate that thing, because you're going to get absolutely stomped <laughs> on the next turn. Hmm. Cortical. Sweet. Get it? Sweet because it's honey? Get it? <laughs> Guess we'll go over... No, it's probably smarter to just stay here. Mm, can you shoot a man? You should try and kill that other guy. Hey. <clears throat> yeah, this is like a relatively stress-free uh, tactics game. And again, I know it's gonna, gonna stop being the case, but... Should I stay at 100? Yeah, probably. That would be a smart thing to do. Oh, but he's just gonna move to this side anyway. Mmm. Might as well... Uh, I could double back and, like, go over here. No, I can't. I lied. Mm. Alrighty, then. I will... Stay put, I guess. Hmm. I lied, I'm not gonna stay put. <clears throat> there is one rabid that I like. And it's Rabid Retrospect Games. The o my go to um no commentary channel for all the current video games. I'm also not biased even a little bit because they're my friend. Not a little bit, I say. Fuck. I mean, perfect. All according to plan. No! We didn't kill him dead. Oh well. Hey, we can get over here. Uh, nice. I'm gonna go into lurk mode so I can rest a bit uh, with Viz's soothing voice in the background. You do that. Oh god, oh god, we're also on fire. Oh, I dislike this. Well, at least I'm technically in 100% cover from one angle. That's good. Hmm. I wish I could, like, chain uh, spring jumps together. That'd be fun. Albeit a little bit OP, I'm sure. Heck, one health! This is... This is the ripoff. <laughs> no, don't kill him. No. I keep wanting to call Luigi Rabbit Luigi Mario. Mario Mario and Luigi Mario. Do I have to gather these coins while I play, or will I get them automatically if I beat the level? Okay, you can try and kill this man. Hopefully succeed. Fuck. Alright, well. <laughs> Worst things have happened, I suppose. <clears throat> ha! 
Shoot him point blank. Kills future children. That's what shooting someone point blank does. I don't know if you know. Little known secret. You try and keep that on the hush hush. I guess that was a joke, but if you think about it for even a second, that's just true. That's just how time works. <laughs> Golden shot! Nice! Battle cleared. Gah! Whoa! It's like those leaves that when you touch them, they like fold in. Which always seemed very cool. Also, there's a mushroom. Do we get big? No, we get health. That's just as good. <gasps> Luigi Mario! Oh, he's scared. <gasps> it's them! He has a power button on his butt. He has a power button. Does Luigi have the most personality out of any of the, like, the Mushroom Kingdom crew? Because he's the only one who has any sort of trait. Albeit that trait is fear. Oh no! It's... Pirabid Plant. Okay. Noxious Fireweed. Nice. <clears throat> Extra health? What? Maybe if I had hit that and been a smart person, I could have, like... Whoa. The music is very intense. I feel like I'm in a boss fight. You look boss-esque, actually. Um... You over there. You over there. I don't know which way to go. Maybe this way. I'm gonna go this way. <clears throat> hmm. I definitely want to try and go farther. I guess I'll shoot his cover, I don't know. Uh, I should, I was gonna go up here and join Mario, but, uh, I should probably leave Luigi Rabbit here to spring on the next turn. I'll do his hero thing, though. I feel like people are going to come into his range. Um, and then Peach has full cover, so we're fine. And by fine, I mean probably not fine. Oh my god. Well, that's horrifying. Oh no! That's quite bad. Oh, I don't know if we're going to be able to get to where I wanted to go. Don't shoot. Mm. <laughs> I love this expression coming out of that tube. Whoa, hey, watch it there. Excuse you. Can I? Hmm. Oh, he's just at the edge of my thing. Um. Alright. Uh, so 30% chance to light on fire, that ain't bad. 
Nice! Very good. Okay, this is becoming a tactics game now. This is like this is like a real video game. With tactical decisions to be made. Okay, and then Mario does this. And then if he went in here. How far could he get? Okay, so we could get to here. I guess put this rabid boy on this cover so that he can sprig barrio. And the barrio go do this and this. And this. And then maybe Mario. Maybe Mario will be able to. Uh, Hit the parade. Nope. That's fine. Um, you need to get. You know what? In retrospect, I probably should have moved Luigi Rabbit to help with uh, Peach Rabbit. But here we are. I kind of wish I had the option to just target the barrels. Barrel. I can attack him and he's out in the open, so fuck it. And if we honey him, ah, uh, I'm gonna say if we honey him, he'll just be exposed. That was definitely a shield time. Uh, can't shoot at nothing, so let's go. Man, this guy does not care about cover. Oh no! Oh, this is quite a bad position to be in. Oh, Peach Bari, Peach Rabbit might die. Oh. Don't look at me like that. Like you're prepared. I don't like that. The animation in this game is really good. Uh, let's do this. And maybe we will do... I think here seems good, but I'm not convinced that I'll have the range on him that I need. Uh, but that's better safe than sorry, as they say. Is there any chance in hell I'll be able to hit him from here? Probably not. We're gonna find out. Oh, nice! Very good. Ah, uh, no burn. Oh well. Okay, Peach, Peach Rabbit. Uh, you can please attack this boy. Hopefully, get a crit or at least something. All right. Get you the fuck out of there. Go back here. Mario's a bit hosed, but as long as Peach Rabbit is in an okay spot. Oh wait, he can move. I forgot that we haven't done our hadn't done our move yet. Well, that's great. That's great, 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 as all the kids are saying these days. Enemies. All alone in the moonlight. No! Not Peach Rabbit. No! I think she's dead. How much health did she have? Like 60? No, don't get that coin. I wanted that coin. I have a lot of health. And now she's dead! Heck. Okay, well. Now we down a person. Time to do some quick learning. On the fly. Do you with this. <laughs> what are the chances we can spring off of our dead allies? Not likely? Not great? Okay. Um. So he can just... Block. Uh, so he can just come up here if he wants. Is the thing. He can just decide to come up here. Um. Okay. What's your movement looking like? 11 health? Not great. Um. Did I shoot at him? Oh, he's out in the open and then just 
hightail it out of here? Seems like the thing to do, right? <clears throat> and then use these rabbit urethras to get the fuck out. Sure, he can still get into a vantage point where he'll still be able to hit us. Oh, thank goodness. Now we can shoot at him when he'd be near one of those things. Well, heck. That's what that feels like. Not great. Oh my god. I really wish all of the enemies had done this like three turns ago. I might as well, like, spin to win. Mario's actually in a pretty good spot. To hit him? Like, actually hit him? Zero percent? What? What? But he's so big. Can I get to the tube? No. Hmm. can't shoot at the boy. The boy behind that other fire cube. That sucks. Alright. Um. I guess I'll have Barrio shoot at him. There you go. And then he'll be out in the open, hopefully for Luigi Rabbit. Then I'll put them on hero site. I don't know, just in case something happens. So you can just shoot them. All right, Luigi Rabbit, it's your time to shine. Uh, may I was gonna say maybe get in range and try and kill that guy, but mm. this is this is not ideal. But shoot this man. Kill this man. Almost certainly dead. Enemy, singular. Nice. Ah, oh, I was hoping for a crit. No, don't do it. Oh. Hey, so uh, this just didn't. This is just a good game. Mario and Rabbids aside, this is just a really well thought out tactics game. Uh, and I like it a lot. Now that I'm actually like in a in a fight that feels consequential, and not kind of just like oh whatever, it's a fucking it's a couple enemies and you get to the other point or whatever. Hey, I did just shoot through that. I did just shoot through that 100% cover, though. That's a thing that I noticed just now. <laughs> Is shooting through that 100% cover, though. All right, Mario. Mario. Hmm. Yo. Yo. Oh, what the fuck? I. Hmm. I do dislike. I think it's the Final Fantasy tactics in me, is that as long as you don't commit to an attack, you can always undo a move. Unless I'm completely re misremembering Final Fantasy tactics and you absolutely can't do that. 
Because then you could, like, go a place and then see what your range of attack was and then plan your thing and then be like, okay, that doesn't work, and then you back down. Uh, enemy turn, I guess. I think Luigi Rabbit is dead. He has one HP. If he trips, he'll die. Heck. Run into him. Catch him on fire. Heck. All right, rabid Luigi, it's your time. Slide kick him to death. Nice. You sure did participate, Peach. Oh my god. <laughs> that is actually literally how that fight went, basically. Oh no, he's just a normal rabbit. That's nice. Cute. Hey, Luigi, you want to get in on this selfie? <laughs> ah, so you're the other half of the fabled duo, Mario and... and... Louis? Lyle. Lulwulun? Er, well, all the same, welcome. To fucking Beepo, don't be like that. <laughs> you did... you did good. You sure did good. And we got health. Thing that I am particularly fond of. That's an interesting <laughs> that's an interesting trophy. I I like it. It's just very interesting. <gasps> Yo! Look at how fucking badass Luigi looks. He looks like he's ready. He looks like he had his own Shadow the Hedgehog spin off game where he gets a gun. Beet juice. Alright, if you don't like ASMR, uh, Kurtzerp has redeemed ASMR, so uh, turn off your ears, uh, mute your stream for just a second. Kurt has asked me to say just one thing Beet juice. Ugh. Thanks, Kurt. Uh, long range shooter. Hit up three enemies in a row from afar. Whoa! Boost team mobility with rad skills. Uh, skill tree unlocked. <gasps> Upgrade your hero. Six new weapons available. Get powerful new weapons for your heroes. I don't know more. Check out the battle HQ now. Why does this feel like. This feels like a DLC advertisement. Introducing call. It actually. Okay, you know what? It actually is. I think it is DLC advertisement. I'm um, introducing co-op mode. Play exclusive co-op battles with a friend. Uh, you can now play the first battle of the Mega Bug Ride campaign. New DLC co-op challenge. You can now play the first battle of Cataclysm Kerfuffle campaign. I wonder if that's online. Get up to eight special weapons. Tap a compatible amiibo. <gasps> Mario and his friends. What kind of amiibos? Hey, Alvis Fear. What's up? Welcome. Skill tree, huh? Mario. Allow Mario to team up with an ally and perform a jump to reach previously inaccessible areas. An attack at an enemy's head following a team jump. Yeah, that makes sense. That makes sense. I like that. I only have 10 of these. How much does this cost? Oh, attack. It costs 10. A uh, close range weapon that can hit multiple targets at once. Increase Mario's weapon damage along with the damage caused by any heroes in range. Uh, allows Rabbit Peach to dash two more. One enemy. Uh, never stops chasing its target. Will detonate when it's close. This is health. Restores health points to all heroes in range. That's pretty good. Um, oh, all of them have their own individual skill points. So if I spend them on Mario, these guys don't spend. But everybody else, their skills look like they cost 20. 
Last time loses during enemy health with a dash. Area attack affecting all enemies within range. Weakens enemy weapons near Rabid Luigi. I mean, we can't unlock anything else. Uh, but is it worth saving, though? So, like, the one on the right seems like support. And other seems like other. <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. Team jump. Uh, never stops chasing his targets. A sentry. That's pretty good. Area of movement is increased for all heroes in range. I honestly think I want to save for everybody else's skills, except for my areas. Because the jump attack just seems way too useful to not get right now. Yes. Stomp jump. Ten enemies have fallen a team jump. Afterwards, Mario lands on a nearby cell. That definitely is what felt like it was missing from the jump attack. Uh, heroes overcome by a super effect are restored when team when Mario performs a team jump with them. Increases damage, Dell performing a dash. Increases Mario's area of movement. Increases stomp jump damage. Okay. Cool. Neat. They have all sorts of weapons now. Although the DLC stuff seems like no question. <laughs> this weapon is horrifying. Unquestionably the strongest one, which I was worried about. I was worried about it completely invalidating all the other weapons. Against Ziggies, against Hoppers. Uh huh. Alright, yeah, everything else is invalidated by the DLC thing. Hit damage. Push chance. Ooh, I do like the fire thing, so I guess I'll get the upgrade to a fire. Because this and this are, like, functionally the same, but this one's free. And this is slightly... This is the exact same, but has burn damage, which... I think I like better than push, although I haven't tried push. You know what? Let's keep this on him and try out push. Uh, against Hopper, Service Enchant, Bounce Chance, damage, Bounce Damage. Ink Damage? Luigi's in a Splatoon now. Maybe Ink Damage will like blind enemies? Cover damage low. Okay. Yep, let's equip the DLC weapon that invalidates everything. Yeah. Can I have all of them? Yeah. Can I change the leader? Oh. Oh. <clears> hmm. <throat> hmm. I think for now, let's try Luigi and Rabbit Peach. Or, I mean, uh, Luigi and Luigi. Of all the Marios. The DLC weapons are strong, early game weapons, so they aren't going to be the best for too long. Okay, that's great, though. Um, cool. I'm having fun. It's just in. Ubisoft, you made a fun Mario game that also features your horrifying mascot character. You got a song. Wow. Wow. <laughs> what? You gotta admire their dedication to hiding. They look very uncomfortable. Yup. It's like the opposite of that trick that they do in movies or media where they hide underwater and use a bamboo shoot so that they can breathe. Which I always thought was really cool. Personally. Those birds are so precious. Look at all of their animation frames that they don't have. That's fine. The animation clearly went elsewhere, which is fine. I feel like maybe I can break this later because we were informed that we could maybe break... A stone looking other thing. Oh, that's a that's a snorkel. 
I was like, why does that look like a familiar thing? It's a snorkel. Bees. Bees. Bee doo boo boo. And that's a transition cannon. I don't want to use just yet. I want to go see what else I can see. More things that are blocked. Eh, blocked. Get it? Just blocks. <clears throat> what is... What does this do? It's a rabid skull, so... Nothing, I guess? Maybe it'll let me redo battles or something in the future? Hmm. Okay, well, neat. Oh, you push the blocks onto them to do something. Oh, it probably opens up this bridge. If I had to hazard a really just wild guess. Let's see where this goes real quick. Oh, wait, these all send us back to the HQ, right? Or am I crazy? I don't remember. Nope, it's this thing. Rap. I wonder if Ubisoft and uh, Nintendo are still on good terms. Like, they've made two games uh, crossovers, which is neat. Well, like, the other one's more of, like, a feature, like Star Fox in that Starlink game. Um, I wonder if they'll make another game. Or if this is, like, probably going to be a franchise that's going to be their main venture. Man... How cool, okay. How cool would it be if the next Rayman, Rayman UB Art Engine video game, uh, was fucking, uh, Rayman plus Mario? Because this is a 2D platformer. That seems like a thing. Also, I'm gonna quit to the main menu. Do you really wanna quit the main menu? I guess. I hope this game auto saves. Hmm, that'd be really cool. I'd be so down for that. And I would definitely want it. But Mar I feel like Nintendo's pretty... Uh, probably pretty guarded about their IPs. Well, they're getting a little bit less. Oh, I forgot that uh, they also um had the crossover. Uh, they let the... Um, uh, oh my god. Cadence of Hyrule. What was the other... The, 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 the thing... The, what's the name of that game? The dungeon game, but it's a dance. It's a it's a beat dungeon. Necro Dancer. Crypt of the Necro Dancer. Thank you. Um, they did that with an indie company, which is super cool. So they're getting a little bit more. Um, they're loosening up a little bit on that type of stuff. I was gonna say they like to keep Mario and them pretty on model and stuff, but. My hope is that if they ever did a Rayman Mario crossover is that they would do Mario and the crew as uh in that art style cuz that art style is real good. Hey guys, uh that's Mario plus King Rabbids Kingdom Battle. Kingdom Death Battle as I tend to call it, which I think is a tabletop system. Um this is fun. I'm going to keep playing this on my own. I don't think I'm going to be doing full stream through of this by any means. Um, I just wanted to do a little Invisio tries and check it out and show it to people who, for some reason, maybe haven't seen this and have waited on it and slept on it for like a million years like I have. That's a really cool game. Uh, yeah. Thank you guys for joining me. I'm going to be streaming uh, Rayman 2. Speaking of Ubisoft and Rayman things, which Rabbids is, uh, I'm going to be streaming Rayman 2 later tonight. I thought I was going to do it back to back. And, like, keep streaming and take a little break in between. But, uh, I am gonna go get food first. And then we'll come back later tonight and we will do the Rayman 2 stuff. Um, who is streaming? What <laughs> in That's what you sound like. Um, let's raid... Malu. Malu is playing Spire Reignited Trilogy. They are a member of the Neighborhood Watch. 
uh, which you, if you aren't aware for some reason, somehow, is the team that I'm a part of. You can click on the team below my stream and see who else is in it, and you can see who's live and stuff, and it's a good, wholesome crew. Um, but yeah, we're going to raid them. They're playing Spyro Reignited Trilogy. I'm going to tag out really quickly because i got to go eat. Yeah, give them lots of Inviso highs and Inviso loves and all that jazz. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for hanging out. I hope you all had fun, and I'll see you in the next one, which will be later tonight, hopefully. Bye-bye!